Hello guys, my name is Aman from 3D Sync. I am a 3D animator. Today we will make this tutorial. Today we will learn how to add and track 3D models in videos with real shadow in After Effects. First, if you are looking for liquid shapes and fresh animations, check this guys from aejuice.com. They already gives you a opportunity to download a free starter pack, but also they have great new stuff like liquid elements and shape elements, liquid transitions and even slideshow creator. Each of this pack have great value and multi-purpose use to make your videos even more interesting to watch. Just visit aejuice.com. All links are in description below. Let's get started. First, open your After Effects, then import your video. After this, drag and drop here. Then, click on Tracker and Track Camera. Wait for few seconds. After this, you will see some little tracker points. Select these tracker points where you want add 3D model. Then right click of your mouse and select create null and camera. Then create a new solid layer. I am using in this tutorial element 3D plugin. Go to effects, video copilot and click on element 3D. After this, click on scene setup, click on import and select your 3D model from where its location. Then click on normalize size. Now you can watch your 3D model. I am clicking on flip this model for exact position. You can see here textures of 3D models. For realistic look of 3D model, click on environment and import a snapshot of your video which you are using for add 3D model. You will notice that model lighting will be changed. You can also change your textures as per your requirement from the presets section. It is looking better. Now click on OK. Our model is in group 1 in element 3D. Now you can change position and rotation and many more from here. Click on track null and select transformation and copy this from the keyboard shortcut control plus C. After this click on element 3D layer, go to group 1 and create group null. Here will be created a new layer group 1 layer. Click on transformation of this layer and paste here copied location of track null 1 by press control plus V. Now click on transformation of group 1 null and click change rotation and position as per your requirement. After this you will see that 3D model tracked with video.
I am trimming composition area as per my requirement. For a realistic shadow, click on element 3D layer, scene setup and create plane and adjust where you want shadow. Click on OK, then set the position rotation again with footage. Now again click on element 3D layer and scene setup. Select plane and click on match shadow in the presets window. Click on OK. Now plane will be hide. Then click on layer, new and select light. Make sure light type is parallel and tick marked on cast shadow. After this, click on element 3D layer. Click on render setting. Click on shadow. Click on enable. Now choose here shadow mode to ray traced. After this, click on ambient. Change SSO intensity as per your requirement. In my project, this is only two. After this, click on light one layer. If your PC will be slow that time, then change here full to quarter. Now change your light location and rotation from your mouse. After adjust light position, click on light option here and click on shadow, darkness and change this as per your requirement. This is looking cool. Now change your preview setting quarter to full. For more realistic look, click on new and create a adjustment layer. Then click on effects and presets. Search here pixel motion blur. Double click on this or drag and drop on adjustment layer. Now select all layers except your video footage. Right click on this and make a pre-compose. Click on OK. Now change brightness and contrast of your video for matching with 3D model. After this, Make a new adjustment layer, go to effects, color and select curve and adjust colors for better look from here. Now your video is ready. Now click on composition and click on add to render queue. Change output mode as per your requirement. I am select format here AVI select output location then click on render. Thanks for watching. Please like this video and subscribe to 3D Sync. We have to work hard to make such CGI and animated videos. Bye bye. See you in the next video.